for in the industry. You know, it makes us disruptors in our industry as a result of that association. Beautiful. Anyone else? Meryl or Greg, do you guys have anything that you'd like to ask? You guys are rock stars. <laughs> uh, yeah. Really good. Really, really fantastic. I thank you for that. And you buttoned it up so fabulous at the end, too. I'm really excited. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, go ahead, Greg. I would love to just get some cutaways. I saw you doing a few of them, but just get everybody, you know, reacting, nodding, that kind of thing. Just just a few uh, seconds on everybody. Okay. But first, anything else you guys would rather say ourselves on a partnership, whatever. Uh, you know, you know what? There was one other thing that I wanted to bring up, and and maybe just tech, because I was talking about the aura of the ship. Like, what are the colors and the textures? What's that feeling that you want the guests to have from from that in itself? You know how you get a feeling when you walk into a space, and the colors and and the and and the textures speak to you, and they give you a certain vibe. That really varies per space. Um, I'll speak about oh. one space that we didn't even touch on, uh, Sid Norman's. Really, that venue, it's an entertainment venue. It's a rock and roll um, bar. And really, the concept behind that was taking you at, as if the bar has been there forever and the ship was built around the bar. Um, so when guests go in this space, it feels authentic. It feels a little gritty, which is not seen in the industry. Typically, you want a really freshly polished space. Um, but you're going to see a little grind and what rock and roll, where it started. It's kind of like a garage band uh, theme environment. Um, so I think in that venue, you really get transformed to one uh, type of bar uh, experience, but then you go to the Galaxy, the galaxy the video, and it's, the it's completely different. It's yeah. like you're walking through a tunnel, like we mentioned earlier. You're walking from one vessel going into another vessel, another type of vessel, uh, another galaxy. Saying you're definitely studying contrasts. Yeah, sure. One hundred percent. And you're going to be constantly surprised and no bored. Sure. But I think it's all also about creating these moments of authenticity. So whether you're at Sid Norman's or you're in Galaxy Pavilion, they all feel very authentic in their own way. Mm -hmm. So I think for the guests, they're really going to feel like they're getting a true authentic experience as if they have traveled to a unique location um, that has its quirks and its mysteries and its uniqueness. We're bringing all that on board the ship. And I think once you leave, you're just going to leave with all these varied experiences, but they're all going to feel very real. They're not going to feel like they're contrived or they've been just kind of thought through entertaining you for a small portion of time but they just feel like they're true to the essence of what they need to be so the french restaurant will feel authentically french in a way the mexican restaurant will feel the same way the atrium space will feel like it's not trying to be anything else but the atrium space and i think those type of experiences are going to serve as a backdrop to be able to just live out your your vacation in a very authentic way I mean, there's a level of thoughtfulness in all the designs. It's been really handled so but we really wanted to make sure guests feel like they were in something that felt real and you know, didn't feel forced, for sure. Yeah, and lastly, I, you know, I'm going to go back to the smallest space on the ship. I hope people feel relaxed and comfortable when they're at their skate park. You know, it's it's important, you know, with all these other sort of hyper activities and things to do on the ship, we need that, that moment of respite from the, the entertainment and everything else. And so I hope people leave with a very restful vacation from sleeping and resting and resting. That's wonderful. Perfect. Thank you so much <laughs> that you nailed that one. Um, yeah, just, um, so I'm just getting more cutaways and, yeah. and, and this has been fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. So what we'll do for cutaways, it's going to be a little awkward, but we'll all act like someone is speaking 
and you know, so all of you guys love you, Greg, and now oh, just give some.